When you leave Walmart after making a purchase, you walk past a scanner that sets off an alarm if you haven't paid for something. And if the alarm goes off at this Walmart, Ed Bauman will want to talk to you. I'm getting too old for this stuff. Too old to be punched in the head by a customer who took exception to Bauman's questions. When he swang, he got me right here behind the ear. The 69-year-old greeter was at the entrance when a man in red shorts identified as Skyler Lowry set off the alarm, but then refused to stop when Bauman questioned him. Bauman went outside to get his license, but watch this. The guy rips Bauman's clipboard from his hands and goes back inside. I grabbed the log sheet, the clipboard back. As I was doing that, he hit me with a doubled up fist behind my ear. And well, the six foot two retired Marine didn't back down. Well, the super, uh, security there said, if you'd hit him in the jaw the way you hit him in the chest, he said you'd have knocked him out. Police arrested Lowry, who would have faced a charge of misdemeanor battery had Bauman been under 65. But hitting an older person is a felony. And Bauman says he still doesn't know why it happened. The alarm was false, and Lowry had a receipt for everything in his bag. Failing to show the receipt in this case meant the difference between 10 seconds and five years. It would have taken 10 seconds to show the receipt, but now he faces up to five years for battery on a person over 65. In Palm Bay, Dan Billow, West 2 News.